<laughs> and put too much paint. We laugh. Should I go with oh. the screen for both of us? There you go. We're both on the screen. We're both Rutter. Yeehaw. Mm -hmm. Hello, hello, hello. Is there anybody out there? They will show up. They will show up. I'm going to share it out. Please, okay. if I don't, they ain't going to show up. <laughs> <laughs> ah. Shelly's out there. Hi, Shelly. You're Hi, our only Shelly. friend. Shelly is our only friend. Yes. She's our friend. We have a friend. We have a lovely friend. We have Shelly. Okay. Now. Woohoo! What did I do with him? Oh, there they are. I found him. He's hiding. I wonder if I go like this. Shelly, forgive us because, you know, we're always running behind. It's always catch-up time. I don't know the list. He's on it. Hi, Clint. <gasps> oh, my Hi, God. Clint. This is just. Ouch. Darn it. Ouch. Who have at it is what's what name? What name is have at it? That's Joe. That's right. I remember that now. Woohoo. Okay. All I right. Got Oh, okay, now I got that. And I know that, but my memory is gone kafui. Oh, 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 oh. So. We're doing good. Yeah. Hi, Joe. And uh, hi, Clint. Yeah. Clint, are you, going to be, are you going to be gel printing? I'm so far away still. All right, Lizzie. I got fabric paints. Do you got fabric paints? Oh no. No. I do. I do have fabric paint, but I don't have it right here. I just got regular acrylic paint. All right. I bought some other stuff that I'm gonna try out. I don't well, exactly. I, okay. I got I'm some. I'm clean with this. I don't know. Oh, that's not good. That is not good. What happened? I would um my my ink print didn't work out. I gotta play with this for a while because I do not know what I am doing. <sighs> You're not the only one, huh? So 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 suck your toe all the way to Idaho when you get there, cut your hair and do it in the county fair. Now, hmm. oh, this goes on the fabric, so you can take this and put it through a stencil or use it as a stamp on the fabric. And then, when you put the stuff on it, the paint on it, this is a resist. All right, and then I got this other stuff that's called Liquitex acrylic mediums for fabric, and it's supposed to be um, you can mix it with the uh paint acrylic paints and it makes it for the fabric it won't make it stiff something like that there's the reason oh that's what it says we'll see i once painted um sweatshirts with house paint made it really stiff i got some daisies or spray fabric spray paint they're like little sprayers yeah they're metallic and then i, I got this the dye and flow. This is uh, jacquard. Jacquard. This is all fabric. I assume it's paint, ink, maybe ink. All right, let's make a mess. Okay. I think that my mess. I'm not sure what my mess is going to be. I'm gonna. Ju I'm just gonna. I just am just gonna be. Um, are you going to use fabric too? Well, I got fabric here. 
but I also have paper. So well, I got paper too. So but I need to make. I I got a lot of fabric. I pulled up all kinds of fabric, different kinds to use to see what will work good. Oh yeah. I got cottons. I got linens. I got canvas. I got muslin. Um, I got eyelet <laughs> and all kinds of stuff. Wow. Yeah. All I have is this torn up sheet. Oh, and then I, I just got white too. That's cool. Um, let's see. I am, I couldn't find my brayer, so I've got this. So this is a free-flowing, concentrated liquid color for use on any untreated fabric, heavy paper, or raw wood. It will spread on fabric until it is thoroughly absorbed and even. It is especially magical on silk, but it works on any type of fiber, natural and synthetic. Every fiber has a different flow and spread. On cotton, the color does not alter the feel of the fabric but this is this has to be heat set afterwards and then you can launder it which i'm sure you might have to do that for um everything that you put on don't you you know i'm i'm just thinking that any paint you use is going to work I think any. They they say fabric paint and acrylic paint and whatever paint and this is for this and this is for that and this is for the other. But I think that's just so that you'll go to the store and buy all that different paint. Well, I mean, the thing is, is that what it does to the fabric afterwards. I mean, I know acrylic paint, unless you thin it down, it's going to make the fabric hard. Really? Uh -oh. Well, yeah. I'm pretty sure it does. Anybody else? Anybody else? Anybody else? Yeah, that's what we need. People to put. Yeah. And, and Joe says she agrees because if you spill paint on something, it doesn't come out. Ooh, so I, I need some stamps. I need stamps too. Sorry, I'm still digging for stuff. Just dig. That's okay. Yeah. I don't, and I'm not sure what I'm doing. I'm just kind of putting some colors on here. And, um, we don't know what we're doing. <laughs> I, and, and I'm just putting some colors on here. And then I'm doing stuff with them. See? And I'm going by the directions. The um, directions of old people with dementia. I need the big dimensional ones for. Yeah, I've done all these before, though. So if Ooh, I get, I do have these big, these big, these big prima girls. I've never done. Might as well pull those out. Oh, I know what I want to get. Oh, I just, I just thought of it. I got some leaves. Clint says he's got a lot of paint. The this only thing fabric medium does is keep the paint from getting hard and crusty. Okay. So that's what that is all about. Ooh. Yeah, hard and crusty. Yeah, we don't want hard and crusty. Um, <laughs> so it's like a thinner then, I guess. Yeah, so you like know, a paint thinner. If you've got um, what is the other stuff you can use? The mediums, whatever. The liquid mediums. So I have this one paint here that says it's airbrush paint. Well, I feel like this. Just throw it at it, see what sticks. Yeah. Oopsie. Oopsie. This. 
And I guess you don't really even need a brayer on your gel pet print pad. You can just put it on with anything, actually. 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 <laughs> oh, this one's cool. This is one of those Jane Davenport faces. One. Does anybody on there, any, anybody, anybody out there live in Florida? Who who's come in? Did I miss anybody? No. I don't know. I but I'm just wondering because there might be some people even that are out in the balcony, the balcony. You know that they're um, they don't speak. But I'm wondering if if anybody's in in Florida and if you are aware that Mother Nature's third cousin is out there. Her name is Elsa. She's being ugly. She's she's got a mood. She's having a mood. Well, her mood seems that she wants to come spend some time right in my area. Yeah. <laughs> she wants right. to come visit with me. We got some stamps. My problem is I don't know where I'm gonna put all this stuff when I need to put it to the side. Actually, I think I'm having fun. Well, you go, girl. I'm going to try to have fun in just a minute. Well, if you just keep going with your red self, you'll be fine. Just be fine. You'll be just fine. Got to do some rearranging. You know how I go. Rearranging? Uh huh. Rearranging. Oh, how bad it is in Georgia. Joe is in, in Georgia. Is she near you? Do you She's know? In She's in Augusta. She's not far. Okay. Yeah, because see, you guys in Georgia, um, you might have to watch out for my friend Elsa as well. Really? Yeah, after she visits me, she might come and see you. I remember that big one that came through last time. It freaking almost pulled our tree up. It's, my tree's bent because of it. That's terrible. That's terrible. I'll be right back. I got to go get my stamp. No, you can't leave me. Stop it. Stop it. Just stop it. All right. There's some semblance of um, chaos. Let's see. I got all my stencils, so that's all good to go. I got three different ones. I got my big 8x10. This one is a... Five by seven. This one is the thinnest one I've ever seen in my life. And then I have this one, which is like a three by five, I think. I also have a round one that's eight by eight, but I haven't busted that one open yet. I can. I know. I'm going to work on it. Let's see what we got. Like, most of my pieces are, like, I did make smaller ones, but I got big ones, too. Let's see. So, like, let's do one on the on the 3 mile 5 first, just to get it warmed up. You got to get it warmed up? Yeah, I got to get it warmed up. Huh. <laughs> You ain't right, Lizzie. Are you going to warm up that, Lizzie? Say that again. I said, you got it warmed up yet? Oh, heck no. Oh, heck no. If I live in Florida, we're always warmed up. We are warmed up. All right, I'll tell you right now, this, whatever this is, come in this jar, these little jars, they are like really super duper uh, liquidy. That's all I can tell you. That's all you can tell me? That's all I can okay. tell you. It's, right. It is not my acrylic. Woo! That's some craziness. Oh, I got some. I got some fun stuff here. Shoot, I wonder how to mix it with that liquid the medium to make it more like paint. See? I don't do nothing but make splotches. 
All right. All right. So I see that I'm going to have to use the, the medium and put the color in the medium to make it thicker. It's too thin. Oh, good. Clint found his plate. So then all you need is some paint and paper or fabric. Clint's on a roll. Okay, now if I take this piece of cloth. Grab you some old t-shirts, some old drawers. Let's let's put jelly plate on. <laughs> That's right. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Now if I take this. All right. Hmm. All right, now. I need a popsicle stick. Thank God I got about a million of these. That's all you need is a million. That's all you need. One million. One million. That's it. That's good. Now, um, hmm. You know what? I, I may be just start just going with acrylic. <laughs> Um, ooh, y'all gotta deal, y'all gotta bear with me for a minute because I ain't done okay. this in a really long I'll, time. It's been I'll like bear a year. With you. I can bear. It's been I a love year. I've been jelly plated in over a year. I haven't either. That's why I couldn't find my, um, my, um, my thingy. I couldn't even remember what it was called. That's why I just called it a thingy. I had to look it up on walmart.com to see what it's called. I said, oh, it's a brayer. Yeah, can't find it. But I found other things that roll. Oh, oh that's well, that makes it much better. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Still thin. Still not thick enough. Let's just, I don't know, throw some color on here. I do have all those, um, I don't like all, that. all the ones from the Dollar Tree, and I know this stuff's pretty thin. Yeah. I got different brands here. Oh my God, this one's like water. Oh God, it's got lumps in it. Oh, good grief. It's got lumps. Now, what if I go like this? Now, what if I go like that? And I go like this. Put, um, mm -hmm. see how thin this stuff is? It's about as thin as that other stuff. Oh, now, see, that is pretty cool. Oh, but that. this one did. It's just different. I gotta get into it first before I start doing good stuff. I gotta remember what I'm doing. It's been a while, y'all. It's been a while. I remember last summer it was so hot in that other room that the paint would dry up before I could even get the paper on it. Yeah, I haven't played with it for a while, so. I'm sure by the time I'm here for like an hour, then everything is going to be just absolutely dandy. It's going to be absolutely dandy. Yeah. Well, that's an ink blot. <laughs> ink blots are good. Ink blots are very good. Yeah. I want some. I want some stampage. Now, see this here piece of fabric right here. If I cut this, let it dry, and then cut it into little pieces, it'll be like beautiful. It'll be like beautiful. Yeah, because sometimes if you make something big and then it doesn't look good, then you make something smaller and it looks beautiful. You cut them in pieces. That's just like any kind of mixed media. You cut it up into ATCs or whatever, and then all of a sudden, voila. It's well, beautiful. that's what I'm planning on doing. I'm planning on making, like, I don't know, tags, pockets, all kinds of stuff. Well, I'm going to be doing slow stitching on mine of some kind. Oh, oh there. Look at there. Look at there. Look at there. See, now that's beautiful. How'd you do that? Uh, how'd you do that? Okay. I got the Dollar Tree paint out. Yeah. <laughs> Just 
just go with the Dollar Tree stuff. It always is the best. But how did you? I've got it. I've got it on my jelly plate, right? Uh huh. Right. Mm -hmm. Use this big stamp. It's a honeycomb stamp. So yeah. I, and then it's got the paint on it, so I just laid it on there, and that did that. So I can do it the other way, and pull off this other one. So okay. what you're doing is you're making your um, jelly peat plate like a stamp pad. Pretty much. Well, that's that's good. That's what I just did on this one right here, because I put these colors. And then you can use your pencil. And you know you can also use sprays, and you can use the alcohol inks. You can use all kinds of stuff. Yeah, I guess you could. You know, yeah. Oh, I need because to use the brayer, not my fingers, Ray. Ray. You can always wash your fingers later on. Yeah, but it's putting fingerprints on the fabric. Hmm. I think I'm just going to put down this base coat and then go over with something else. Then it'll be really cool. We'll sop it all up. Sop it all up. All right. Now we do a contrast color on it, right? Okay. So if it's green, let's do a... Let's do pink. Let's use this pink. This is neon. Maybe I should just took out one plate. I'm thinking I'm like this jelly plate over here with five different plates. Well, there. See, I put color. Then I just stamped memories. So I'll cut these out when they're dry. Memories. And then I can make tags. Okay, I'll put that up right here and have it. Let it dry. 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 Oopsie. Now I gotta clean my mat, my pet, my vat, my this. I gotta clean my doohickey. Now. Oh, Duma fudgy, Duma fudgy, gotta clean my Duma fudgy. Oh! <laughs> what? My fairy just rolled up into the brayer. Have we got anybody else in here? Well, a whole seven. Hello, New Yorkers. We have, does it show a number up in the corner of your screen as to how many people? I see seven. Okay, so that's how many we have then. It doesn't show in my screen. We had three. Then you and me make five, so there's two lurkers out there. Yay, I love lurkers. Because then I'm not the only lurker. That's some neon pink on there. But if we stay on like, oh, that's pretty. If we stay on like all night, like some do, then um, other people might find us and feel sorry for us and watch. <gasps> See, there's Teresa Beer Hill. Uh huh. Uh huh. Hi, Teresa. What if we're I your, some of this we're, your glad, we're your glad. We're glad that you came in, Teresa. Did you bring cookies? Oh, that's right. I can't eat cookies. Girl. What? I have to tell you later. I got my results back from the doctor. Oh, man. I'm pretty good, except for two things, and of course I know what they are. Mine are, mine are, my yeah, I got my results back from the doctor, and they said, this is what they said. They said, eat less and exercise. What the heck is that all about? Oh, mine even went so far as to show me how to go on Google and pull up 2,000 calories and look at it. Oh, good grief. I was like, man, I don't know. I need 2,000 calories per meal. Not really. But they did increase my insulin. I don't like that, that they had to do. But you know what? The weirdest thing, I don't know if anybody does their blood sugar thing, but I took my blood sugar this morning. And now, they want it to be like under 150 on a fasting. So it was like 168, I think. 
I when I got up, 168. Okay. Then all I had was water, only water. Two hours later, I took it and it was 197, something like that. It was like 20 points higher from water. How could that possibly be? How could that possibly be? I know, I know it. So, yeah, I'm going to be careful. I'm going to be careful what I eat. Well, that was one of my issues. Was your sugar? Yeah, my A1C went up a little bit. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. And then, you know, the other one, which is always my issue, is cholesterol. Cholesterol, cholesterol. We do not need cholesterol. But they said the rest was all right. And I was rather shocked. That's good. That's good. If everything else is all right, then you're going to live to be 150. 150. 150 years old. No, Lizzie, no. No? I may yeah. have ruined this one right here. I'm <laughs> only going to live to be 100 years old. I think I... Uh-oh. I did... Throw that in the garbage. Um, I'm going to put glue on it. You're going to put glue on what? <laughs> Chill. Like... Oh, now so you're confusing me. And I never get confused. Mm -hmm. What? Mm -hmm. Okay, right. now. Don't watch us. Don't watch us. Us chickens. Now look at this. My fingers are getting all full of paint. How come that's happening? How in the world could my finger... Oh, you know what I want to do? I want to put this here. And then I'm going to put... Um, let's see. Then I'll get this purple. I guess you could do the same thing with Vaseline for the resist. I never did any resisting things. So you're going to have. There is Janice Glines. Hello, Hi, Janice. Janice. Miss Janice is right there. Pretty as you please. There she is. So, let me see. I don't know, guys. She's so pretty. She's so pretty. Maybe I should just stick to paper. Mm. <laughs> we are... Oh, no. This is like rubber in the top. We on the struggle bus. Ceram coat sunshine pearl. Okay. Janice, we're we're thinking about doing some gel printing. We're giving it some thought. So um I tell you what, this lady I watched do it on YouTube made it look so much easier. Shocker, right? Uh, yeah, see, that's what happens is um, the experts get on there and what's the matter, Oliver? Oh, that was not you. That was you, Joey. Okay. Um, the experts, they practice and practice and practice and then they when they get it perfect, then they make a video and then um, and make it look all that easy and stuff. And um, and the keyword there is stuff. Yeah. And so then you say, oh, that looks easy. I can do that. And then guess what? It's you can not... do that. So I can do that. But see, the thing is, we do not have to make our stuff look just exactly like somebody else's stuff. Never. Our stuff can look special. Never. Mm-hmm. Oh, you can see the resist. That's pretty cool. Look, you see the spots? Oh, that is. It was supposed to be honeycombs, but it just didn't work out like that. <laughs> but yeah, it works. If I can get it to work. <gasps> oh, I just remembered something I did once before. You can I think you can use Vaseline. Ooh, that's oh, that's ruin my stand. 
Maybe I should use these uh, homemade stampy things. Yes, use homemade stampy things. That's a good idea. Instead of uh, until I can figure out what what exactly I'm doing. Right. Spread it on thick like peanut butter and jam. Okay, now. I know you got your uh. I know you got your uh. Bubble wrap out, right? Who me? Yes. Well, I do have bubble wrap. I don't have it right here in my reach. Well, you know what I found that was cool? Have you ever seen what? these things? My husband had these. You put them on your forehead when you're sweating. Oh, yeah? And it makes good texture. Yeah. Hi, Jeffroni, oh, Jeffrey. Mm -hmm. Okay. Jeffrey he, woke up. He waved at you. Okay, he waved at me. Okay, that's all I need. Yay! Okay, now. <laughs> my pretty paper. That's kind of pretty paper. My wipe-off paper, because I'm using this here thing for a brayer. Now where, oh, there it is. Now where, oh, there it is. So I'm just going to... Put this on here. Ooh, that's pretty. Yeah. And that's a piece of fabric you got that on? Yeah, a piece of white cotton. Yeah, see? Ooh, I like this. I think I got my little ink a little bit ink. I always call it ink because I was a, um, what do I call myself? I used to be a screen printer and we used ink. And so now I always call my paint ink because you, always... you can use alcohol inks on it. It won't mess up the jelly plate. Yeah. Oh, but my inks, the inks that we used where I worked at was like, I don't know what it was. It was, it was in my opinion, it was paint, but it was. Just don't, <laughs> just don't put the resist on it. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I know nothing about resist. Nothing. And I get, I got proof when chocolate comes in the house, you know. <laughs> you can't resist that? No, I can't resist that. Man. Now that is too thick. So I'm just going to roll some off on this paper. I need a nurse now. I need a stamp. Need a nurse? Yes, I need I need that one one. <laughs> Let's see what I got. Hmm. Okay, now I'm gonna go over here. I got this big sunflower. That would be pretty, huh? Yeah. Thank you, Shelly. Shelly says this, that mine looks good. She said that. Way better. Nope. I'm just putting paint on. This is pretty cool, though, I think. Well, so I wonder if I were to um, take a piece of... Okay, I got to move this paper over here. All right. So what if I put this flower stamp... Oh, my fingernails are really looking lovely underneath. They're so lovely. La, 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 lovely. lovely. So maybe I'll just play on this paper right here. And see what happens if I make a... Hello, puppy. Come here, Shaggy. Shaggy. Mm -hmm. hmm. It's kind of a sunflower. I bet it'll look good now. And then it's Bootsy 
It's Bootsy Bootsy. and June's handmade creations. Hello. Come watch us jelly. And do stuff we have no idea what we're doing. I know what I'm doing. I am making a mess. That's because you're the pro, Liz. I'm the pro mess maker. Pro mess maker. Takes a lot of experience to become a pro mess maker. That's kind of crazy, right? <gasps> it made it on the front and the back. Look. There's a... Look. Oh, that is so cool. It looks better on this, I know. But it's cool. You see how the stuff... I don't know if you can see. You see how the stuff... It, it did her funky thing. I see the funky. It's like, I don't know, like blurred? Would say it was your knee joint. It was not my rolly thing. <laughs> <laughs> I think you need to get a couple pieces of paper just to pull stuff on. So, so what did I do with my book? No telling, no telling what you did. That's the question. That's the ten million. Sixty-four thousand dollar question. Do Do you remember anything about the sixty-four thousand dollar question? Um, Probably not, because you're just a spring chicken. That wasn't the pyramid thing, was it? No, it was before that. I don't know. I may have watched it. Okay. Mostly it was the pyramid and what was the other one? The matching game. The uh, the honeymoon thing. The I used to love to watch. What was it? The honeymoon thing? You said the honeymoon thing. The newlywed game. Oh my gosh, that used to be so funny. The newlywed game. That was it. Yeah, that was funny. I used to like to watch that. That was hilarious. I've been watching some of the, um, oh, what is that game where they got the two? Oh, Family Feud. Oh, Family Feud. I, I used to love it when the other guy was on it, though. The old guy. Oh, yeah? I don't guess I ever watched it. I've only watched it late, lately because they just show up <laughs> on my, um, on my, on my thing they show up on my thing and and so i watch it but oh my gosh some of them people get a little feisty with their answers and i get i turn all red in the face i said did they say that really mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. They're, they're not scared to say some of them words i'm scared you're not scared I'm oh. scared. Ooh, ooh, that could be interesting. Well, see, now I just figured I can put paint down on the plate and then pick some off with these rubber stamps, these foam stamps, to rubber. take them off. Yep. And then put the fabric on it and then you can kind of see you can kind of see the image then i think i like that yeah that's better than doing the resist oh if i didn't mess that up i think i just can wash it off you didn't mess nothing up girlfriend girlfriend you no no mess no mess you're good yeah i do so much better on paper look at that yeah I kind of like, because I like using fabric lately, that I think I'm going to use this painted fabric on some things. You I need, kinda, to, make, you need like, to make something fabulous with it. I'll make some, but see, I'm making my little, my little journal things, you know, my little pillow, couch pillow journals, and with my slow stitching stuff. And, um... 
Yeah. And, and so then I can take a piece of paper. I mean, a piece of fat. God, I love this rolly thing. This is so cool. Okay. But anyway. I haven't made a mess in so long that I played with paint and got it all over my hands. This is absolutely fun. It's absolutely fabulous. Yeah. Gosh, you should have talked me into this a lot sooner. Ooh, what color is this? This is one of my favorite things to do. Is it? <clears throat> Usually, now see, I'm in my sewing room right now only because this is where my camera is. But um, usually when I do something like this, I'm in my other room, my craft room. Try a different kind of fabric. I got this stuff. Okay, now. Some remnants. This stuff right here is hard to tear. Let's see what we get. Hmm. Boy, I need a clothesline in here. You need a clothesline? Hang my fabrics up. I'm just kind of throwing them around. Hopefully the dogs don't walk on them. <laughs> but little paw prints on them will be cute, though. Yeah, that's why I put that paper down behind me. Ooh. Ooh. That's a little different. That's pretty. Yeah. Pretty. Very it is, pretty. It is making this thin stuff kind of hard. But I'm supposing that if you maybe set it and then wash it, it might get softer. Oh, Bootsy is going to dine while he's watching. He's going to, so that the, he'll be having like a little dinner theater. All right. Mm -hmm. That's right what it on. is. A little dinner theater. You know, I know somebody that I watched use um, black gesso to pull off. But the only black gesso I have is heavy body. I don't have like the thin kind. <sighs> I have watched, there are some um, experts, I'm telling you, they can do some some gel printing that is amazing. Some of them let the, the, it, the paint dry a little bit on their um, paper, and then they put more paint on it. And you got to know the time and stuff to leave it. But they come up with such awesome stuff. I still haven't mastered the technique of pulling up an image off of a... Oh, yeah. I've tried that, but no, that kind of just didn't... didn't I tried so me. hard last summer. You don't know. I spent like a whole weekend trying to do that. Yeah. I guess to get any of those... and To learn to do any of those... Um, those procedures like that that you have to really play around with it a while and get the feel of it and stuff and and yeah yeah it takes a minute to get back to get the feel of it right but see that's what we do is you know we don't have to be experts at anything what we want to do is just do the best we can with what we have and have fun. And whatever shows up, shows up. And it's all good. Gets on your finger, just wipe it off. Yes. And so, and if it makes you happy, makes you smile, then you know you did a perfect job. Perfect job 
Mundo. Now, see, I am going to be taking this here fabric that was just a bed sheet at one time of its life. And when I, when it is all dry, I can tear this. Oh, there's Kilburn's Creations. Hi, KK. Oh, that's KK. That's, see, I knew that too, but I forgot. I got to write that down. Kilburn's. Welcome to the party. There we go. Got to write my cheat sheet. But anyway, um, but yeah. I'm telling uh, you, the oh, paper is so much crazy. different. So much different. The, the fabric won't pick up the bits. That's what makes it cool, the bits. My fabric is, I think my fabric's awesome. And then my 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 sheets my paper sheets that i'm kind of wiping stuff off on is awesome i'm getting happy here i'm gonna have to change my to, uh, name to happy ray of scrap and lizzie sunshine <laughs> happy ray of scrap and lizzie sunshine oh my lord it doesn't take much to make me happy though i'm telling you what's the truth it doesn't take much Let's turn some of this over the top. I'm getting crazy with the colors. But if that hurricane gets here, you know what? I'm even excited about the hurricane. What the heck? Let's go ahead and be excited about the hurricane. Are you going to have a hurricane party? I think we should. We did have a hurricane. There was one when I was still working. When I was still employed. When I was young. And I was employed. At the... um at the assisted living facility an old folks home whatever you call it when we had a hurricane come through we were re required to stay the night and but we could bring our family along we all had to be there and which was we had so much fun because the at the hurricane never was anything serious you know there was um high winds and a lot of rain and stuff but i'm telling you the cook was in the kitchen cooking all the awesome stuff and the the residents were just we were watching the news you know to see where where the hurricane was going and we just ate and we had the most everybody wearing their pajamas it was great it was a party. It was a hurricane party. We stayed two nights. Thank you, Shelly. Two nights. And it was fun. So this piece I've got is kind of like um, a gauzy kind of, you know, like those shirts are made out of love that are real like light and airy. Oh, yeah, light and airy. Uh-huh. We'll see what this is going to do. I'm going to let it try to dry just a minute. Okay. You do that. You do that with your bed self. I think I should have watched the video again. <laughs> no. See, if you watch the videos too much, then you um, end up trying to do something just like somebody else did. And well, then... It's just that I don't know exactly how to lay the paint down. Well, just keep playing. I don't either. I'm just laying it down. Laying it down and picking it up. Lay it down and pick it up. That's all. That's it. It's simple as that. How do I get this thread in here? Let me just put that right there. Okay. And good thing I put this. Good thing I put my apron on. I don't put paint on my this new. the best shirt Ooh, that's kind of cool oh. oh did you that is cool well i need to be watching you how did you do that how did i you... i had the paint there's paint underneath from when i was doing the paper and then I put the stencils on top of it and I put the um, magenta on top. 
Oh, okay. On top of so this. Now thing. I can pull these off and I can use these. But look at that. Wow. I think we can do the corners with these. I need more room, Lizzie. Just build a wing onto your house. No big deal. I don't have enough. <laughs> oh, and there's Eugenia from the middle of Oregon. 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 <laughs> I, I always used to say Oregon, and then somebody said, no, it's Oregon. I said, well, then why is it O-N? It's N. I live all the way down in Florida. So how am I supposed to know Oregon? And so apparently... Oh, I want to pull this with the paper. I'm sorry. It's going to look really good with paper. <laughs> Which one says he's been described as light and airy. <laughs> that could be me too. Light and airy. That's good. Yeah. Light and airy. I want to be light and airy like Brother Bootsy. What color should hey. I pull it with? Whatever color floats your boat. I don't want to pull it with a dark color because it's kind of dark. I want to pull it with something. How about a gray? You think a gray would be good? La la la. A bushel and a peck. A bushel and a peck. And a hug around the neck. Oh baby. Oh hi. This uh this mustard color is in and this kind of looks like mustard. Let's just do it. Mm -hmm. Mustard color is in. Yeah. Is it you mean like people are using things mustard color? Yeah. Well, my mother once had her kitchen. All the no, it wasn't the kitchen. Yeah, no. The bathroom, the bathroom, mustard color sink, mustard colored toilet. It was not pretty. It was not pretty. Okay, you don't have to call it mustard. You can call it harvest gold because once upon a time, that's what it was called. That is what it was called. Everything was either harvest gold or then that um, green. Avocado Whatever green. They, it was what? Avocado green. And mustard gold, yeah. And when I built this house, well, I didn't actually pound a nail, but when this house was built, it was all of that, like, rose color and, like, a Wedgeford blue, Wedgeford wedge, and geese and all that stuff. Oh, my gosh. My carpet is that same blue still. And Woo! Yeah. So, it's run its course. Come but on, it was baby. pretty. It was pretty. I thought it was beautiful. This paper that I use, I like to print on. It's from this book. It's called The Motion Picture Guide. It's from the Spilet Film. It doesn't have any pictures except in the right in the front part. But all the rest of it is just writing. And this paper is like the best for jelly plating on. Really? I will say. I use it every time. It makes nice. Jelly. I think my papers are going to stick together. Ooh, Lizzie. What? Ooh, Lizzie. I'm going to get another one off of here. Get that one. Oh, you are really coming up with some beautiful stuff. It looks much better on the paper, though. It is beautiful. Well, I'm doing paper and fabric. I'm doing like a little of each. Now I've got to figure out how to get it <laughs> Oh, yeah. Burnt orange went with it, Eugenia. Yep. Oh, yeah. Burnt. Burned orange. Let's try some nectarine on here. Oh, this was deep. <laughs> There's your knees again, Bootsy. Squeaking. Your knees is squeaking. Just a squeaking. The problem is, is that the fabric doesn't stick 
like the paper does. So it doesn't get all them little remnants that are on there. You know what I'm saying? Oh, I know. Because there's like goodness under there that's dried and dried because I've been layering it. Yeah. If you can see it. You see? Yeah. See? But the fabric won't pull that up. Well, see, you are just like a master of disaster. No, not that. Let's you are like a jelly printing magician. Okay, now I got some. I don't know what this is. I'm I'm thinking this is some kind of uh, furniture fabric because it's real thick. Oh, I have to um, have something else mixed with this color. Blue. We have a corner. Corner here. Yeah. Corner. On the corner. The corner. On the corner. Maybe if I press down real hard. Mm -hmm. like That's some watery paint right there. That is some watery paint. How about if I go like this with it? Oh, that's not rolling. That doesn't want to roll. Okay, so we're not going to use that. We'll use this because it wants to roll. All right. Okay, yeah. That's what we want to do. That's what we want to do. We want to do it. We want to do it. We want to do it. What do you think? Oh, that's pretty. It's all right. Yeah. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. It is beautiful. This is fun, Eugenia. Just like, just it's just fun. Yes. Pull out all them paints that you never opened. Pull out all them stamps you've never taken out. Mixed in the color. Oh, that one. The color didn't mix good. I have to put some more color on this one. Not not happy. That's not making Elizabeth happy. Did you Elizabeth, know what? What? You can always wash them, and it doesn't hurt them. No, I, but what I believe, though, I'm not going to wash, well, I could wash these. You know, I might wash a couple and see what happens when you, you wash them. do that. But see, I do plan, there goes Bootsy. Bootsy, would you quit with them knees? <gasps> Samantha Owens. Oh, man. Hi, Samantha. Beautiful Samantha Owens. All right, let's see if I can pull this uh, car. Sure, you can pull the car. If you get a strong enough rope, you can pull the car. Okay. <laughs> You're so silly. Well, you said you wanted to pull the car. I do want to pull the car. Oh, iron them first to set the paint. That's what Bootsy said. Yeah, we have to iron them before we can wash them. Oh, I, see, I didn't know that. So, so iron it. Would you put like a ironing cloth over it before you iron it? Yeah, it said reverse it and then iron it. But I guess if you got it on both sides, that's kind of not going to work, is it? Oh, well. Hmm. Oh, maybe if you were to put um, like um, freezer paper or something and iron or parchment paper, maybe. Yeah. Maybe. Could try that. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's better. Now I like that color better. That's more they're better. There's more they're gooder. So we need to take the fabric that we make and we need to sew something with it. So I'm going to, so I don't know what I'm going to sew with it, but I'm going to sew something with it. And no! um, it didn't work. What? It didn't work? No. Oh, I'm sorry. How about I pick it up with the paper? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It just doesn't work the same. I'm sorry. It's not your fault, Lizzie. Oh, parchment paper, maybe, says Janice. And Janice is smart, so I would go with that. Ow, I keep pressing my leg against the leg of the table. I do I do have some freezer paper, too. Let's see. Let's see. 
Let's see, Bessie. Hmm. Well, you see these colors I'm putting down, don't you? Somebody's wanting Halloween, Halloween to come real quick. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, you know what I think I'm going to do now that I think about thinking? Boo! What? I'm going to go check on Jeffrey. He's too quiet. I'm going to make sure he's okay. Oh, he his headphones in. Check on my grandchild. I'm going to have to dip it in paint and then just stamp it on there. Is that what? What color should we make it? Hot dog. Oh, the husband is down there doing manly work. I hear him with some kind of gun. Have you heard from your mom? All right, we just going straight through the fabric. Uh, pass the jelly plate. Is she working? Oh, she is. This should work. Should that for her because she's making money and she can buy you things. And um, that's not good for you because you don't get cold. You have to stay you know, hold up here in this place here. Stay intact. Not too much. And <laughs> what not to do when you're trying to fabric paint. Uh, maybe it is the acrylic paint. Maybe I do need to go for the <laughs> Are you all good in the hood? Good in the hood. I had to go check on my little Jeffrey. Which he's doing fine. He's got his little doggy. He's got a little shaggy. Little shaggy, yay! Hmm. So, now, what do I want to do here? <laughs> it's a $500 million question. Yeah. All I know is mine's going to look grungy. Grungy? We what? like grungy. Grungy look is always good. I can't seem to make anything else. I am going to. This chili plate right here is butamus, though. Yeah, that's what you're going for is butamus. I love this stamp. This is really an awesome shape. So I'm going to stamp it right on this book page. That is cool. And stamp this on this book page and then put this part on this fabric. I think I have the most success pulling the, the grungy stuff up with um, with this canvasy stuff. Yeah. Yeah. 
All right, everybody, hold your breath. What if we start turning purple? Then you can breathe out of the side of your mouth just a little bit. Okay. Oh, that's cool. That's cool. That's not bad. I like that. Oh, that's going to be neat and that dries and I can put it on a tag. Then I want to do this one too. <laughs> That's the problem. It soaks up the top layer, but it doesn't get the bottom layer. See, look how good that bottom layer is. Yeah. Maybe you have to leave it on the, the fabric. It has to be wet. The paper, it can be dry. Oh, the fabric has to be wet? Yeah. Oh, interesting. Because otherwise, it's, got, it's not going to take anything you put down on it. Okay. All right. I'm pulling it. Pulling it on paper then. I'm just plain old. Yeah. But this one should be a good one. Mm hmm It will be. Because I put that stamp in the little typewriter in the corner. Mm-hmm. 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 I'm already running out of place to put stuff. That's okay. I'll just put stuff on top of other stuff. That's nice right there. That is nice. That is beautiful. Oh, you know what I need? I need some red. So I won't put some red here. And then I want to get it swooshed on here like this. Swoosh. Oh, very good. You made it back. Oh. You made it back? Yeah. I think we took a long run with what Did ya? Yes, you took a long. Let me see her for a minute. Yeah. But it's dry. My paint's dry. Okay. Come here. Come here. Wait. Oh, she, she does not like me. Oh, you see that? Take a look. See that black spot? That's oh, look at there, shiny. Okay, shiny. Aww. she doesn't like her grandma yet. She just wants Jeffrey. That's all. <laughs> Daddy is my boy. She hasn't got used to me. They say that little shizus like that are they 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 um they choose one person that they that they want to be with and he she has chosen her Jeffrey. Yeah, that's the way the the, the um chihuahuas are too. Yeah. No. I think it's gonna take one more time. Well, the typewriter didn't come out. Hmm. 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 You know, that's too much paint. I wonder if I put these two pieces together. And I think I'm going to dry too much while I do. Pull them apart. All right. Oh, no. Oh, what? Paper down. Paper down. Paper down. <laughs> My paper whiffed up into the floor because of that. Man.
All right. Oh. What's his knees again? Oh my goodness, I haven't been watching to see if Martha even was coming in. I Martha, haven't seen out there. Yet. Martha, if you out there, why are you waiting here? I haven't seen her yet. But then it's Friday night. Who oh, no, she might be out to Moose Club or something. Yeah, she might be partying down. Partying yep. like a rock star, because you know she's a rock star. That's right. Boy, we're going to have a lot of paper and a lot of fabric to play with. I like to put mine in a journal. Mm -mm -mm. Oh, my iron is still on. I'm going to turn that sucker off. There now. Ooh. <laughs> that one. If I let that dry some and then put green. Right. It's green. We need another color. Some color shift. Do I even need another color shift that's open? This is so cool because this stamping thing has got little onesies on it like a baby for a baby. And yeah. so so that my my wipe off papers there are really cool. Oh, there's Smiley. Smiley Gamer. Hello. I don't know Smiley Gamer, but I'm assuming that Smiley Gamer um, probably games. You think? And smiles while he's gaming. <laughs> or he. We are playing with paint and jelly plates, Smiley. Do you do any painting with like jelly plates and paint? The gel plate don't like this shit. Paint and gel plate and a roller and stamp. Paper and fabric. You do both of those, Smiley? Very good. There's Denise, Denise DeMille. Meow. Ooh. And she says, oh, she says, hello, Lizzie. Love your inspirational videos. Thank you. Thank Hi, you. Denise. Lizzie, that's purple, but you can't tell. It looks blue. It does look blue, but blue is pretty. It's not blue, it's purple. Oh, Smiley uses paper and pencil. So you're, uh, you must be an artist. Oh, yeah. I like the color, too. We like any kind of artists to join us. And because um, we learn from each other. 
Now, I first started just only knowing one thing. Well, then I watch people and then they do something and then I got to do whatever they're doing. Because I'm a, like a monkey see, monkey do kind of person. Monkey see, monkey do. I don't know why. Yeah. That's right. That's what, what you got to do. What's going on with my roller? Like all of a sudden it's not rolling. Yeah, I think I might order me a, like a real roller. Because I, I was looking on Walmart.com and they're not very expensive at all. And and But they have a whole bunch of different ones. And then they have one that say it's just <gasps> Martha. There Hi, she the is. There's Martha. I knew he was in the background. She was in the balcony, flirting with the janitor. Uh huh. Our wiener dog thinks himself hung the moon. <laughs> I'm just here to fill the food bowl. Yep, I'm telling you, I got two of them, Doxy's girlfriend. Mm hmm. And one of them has a shirt that says, "Eat, sleep, poop, and repeat." That's pretty much. What they do. And they're retired now because they're old. They're retired. They don't even bark when strangers come to the gate. <laughs> I'm telling you. They don't. They retired. They retired. Yeah. Oh, she just got home from the grocery store. Oh. What'd you buy us for dinner? What you cooking there, Martha? Martha. Martha. Mm-hmm. Martha. I don't know why the... Uh... <gasps> Cordula Price. Hello, Cordula. That's Hi, Cordula. My, that's my friend Cordula. She's... We're almost twins. She, we're both. She's gonna be the same age as me in just a few days. Holy smokes! Yeah. So we're like we're like almost twins. We're like almost twins. We decided we are twins, though. We gave that. We we gave that some serious thought. I love that name, Lizzie. What? Oh my gosh, that's so awesome! You are doing a fantastical job. All I did was put the paint down and put the stencil down and then rolled over it. So there you go. There you do go. <laughs> Smiley says, I know what both of you are making. You're making a mess. That's right. And we love it. Mm -hmm. We, see, now for me anyway, when I was <coughs> a young child, I was not, oh, she, Martha bought stuff for taco salad for the fourth. Okay, we'll be there. But um, when I was a child, I was not allowed to make a mess. I had to just clean the mess, clean the mess, clean the mess. That's all. So now I'm making up for it. Make the mess, make the mess, make the mess. I know, I know. It's about time we get to make our mess now. Because that's all we did when we was growing up was clean the mess. I don't even know what I'm doing. I'd say, Mama, can I go to the school dance? Well, if you do the dishes, you can they go to the school. That's what you say if you do the dishes. You can do the dishes. Otherwise, that's a yeah. name. Seems like anytime I asked for anything, she said, if you do the dishes, you can yeah. mm -hmm. So that was pretty much the cost of everything. Ah! Happy anniversary to whoever's anniversary it is. Who is it? I don't know. I think it was. I have to. Oh, Smiley Gamer. To Simpers? I haven't been in a long time. I know. I know now. I know now. Simpers, my gamer buddy. No, I haven't been in a long time. 
Oh, it's, Joe is having her 28 year anniversary tomorrow. What? Well, Joe, I'm glad you remembered because me and Papa, we had our anniversary on the 28th and we both forgot it. And on the 30th, somebody said, oh, I'm sorry that I'm saying happy anniversary late. And then I said, Papa, did we miss something? <laughs> we missed our anniversary. I'm so happy you. anniversary, Joe. 28 years is worth celebrating. I'm telling you. Stay with each other for that long. And that is lovely. La, 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 lovely. Hmm. There's not many people that stay married that long anymore. People just give up. They give up. They don't like what wife cooked for dinner, so they get a divorce. Yeah, that's what they do. That's what I want to tell my husband. I don't like what you cook for dinner. <laughs> we'll divorce. Forget a divorce. I don't like that dinner. I don't know what has happened. What has happened to my brain, but it don't want to roll no more. Yeah. Please explain it. Bootsy says 78 years is this is four seven year itches. Oh. <laughs> Joe said they both forgot theirs a couple years ago. Oh. Eugenia, these jelly plates are really kind of fun things. And you can do different things on my floor. Do oh. Different things with them, you know? It's fun. It's just just Flipping fun. I Flip. jelly plated all over the floor. Because how did you jelly plate the floor, my sister girlfriend? Because <laughs> I'm extremely talented that way. Mm -hmm. It's all good. It's all good. You're, you're a Georgia Bell. You shouldn't drop anything in the floor. Oh, please. Because I'm such yeah. a good bell, I can't never reach anything that I do. <laughs> yeah. Right, Joe. It does take work to make a marriage. I mean, it takes some give and take, and it takes work, and it takes understanding, and it takes sometimes you got to go hide in the closet. Just I tell my husband, leave me alone, but don't go away. Yeah, and then in five minutes I'll be fine. Uh, once I once I tried to run my hubster off when we were first together, I thought, yeah, no, I don't think so. I don't think this is gonna work. And so one day I I planned the whole speech. And so he was watching football and I got my whole speech and I says, you know, I just don't think this will work. We were getting along just fine, but then I thought, no, I'm raising my son by myself and I want to just do it by myself and I just and, and so I spoke to him and I spoke to him for quite a while trying to explain to him that he's just going to have to move back out because it's just not going to work. And because um, I just don't even want to try all this stuff. This was years and years ago. And then so he listened calmly to me. And you know what he said? He said, could you move over just a little bit? I cannot see the television. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. No. And that was over 20 years ago, and he's still here. <laughs> Hubby proposed to my four kids before he did me. Oh, my gosh. That is so awesome. Joe, that is awesome. I love that story. I love that. That is awesome. <coughs> that is yeah i love things i love hearing stuff like that <coughs> gotta get me a little drink here take you a drink a drink maybe that sticky stuff has made it stick <sighs> 
I bet you that's what it was. Cordula says in December it's going to be her 42 second anniversary. Wow. She'll be, have been married 42 seconds. <laughs> <laughs> All righty then. That's right. I don't know. That's right. That was a quickie. It's hard to believe, though, um, 42 years, because you're only 44 years old or something like that. You must right. have married. You were two. Two years of age. Let's see. Do I have room for more paper? I'll just throw it over here. I'm not mastering this very well, Lizzie. Yes, you are. You are the master of disaster, and there's the proof right there. Definitely master disaster. Okay, I'll find another color that I'm not bored with. Oh, here's this pretty paint that I got from Mo from Mona. Mona, Mona. Mona, Mona. Mona, Mona. It's like um, Pebio, Pebio, high viscosity. Yeah, she sent me this. Well, that's it, kind of interesting. Like a long time ago. And it's like awesome paint. Oh. I think it looks like waterfalls. Oh, Doesn't see? It? Cordula says they've been together 48. Um, I think she lived the same kind of life as I did. Me and Papa's been married for 20 years, but been together for 24. <laughs> Or three. 24 million. 24 or 23, something like that. I don't know. Wait a minute. I got to count on. Hang on. I got to count on my fingers. 98. 98. 118. 19. 20. 21. Yeah. 23 years we've been together. 20 years we've been legally together the other years it was like illegally <laughs> she was shacking up uh-huh that's it shacking i up. wasn't always the um i wasn't always the fine upstanding um fine upstanding creature well I just had cold feet. I just had cold feet. That's crazy. all. Had cold. What's crazy? How it wasn't like there wasn't that dark in there. Now the dark is there. That's pretty. It looks like a waterfall. Yes, it does look like a waterfall. All right. No, 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 no. I think a lot of these I'm just going to have double brown. <laughs> Eugenia says, my mom retired from housework when I was about 10. Uh-huh. I know that feeling right there, Eugenia. My mama did too. That's why she had me. Mm-hmm. I want to really like this fabric. I really going to like the colors of this fabric. I think that it's going to be fun when I start slow stitching on this. Or if I cut them apart and put them back together in a crazy quilt fashion. I don't know if I like the fabric better than the paper or the paper better than the fabric. Oh, I know what I want to do now. Oh, where did I put that? Where did I just put that? Just oh, there it is. Here it is. Here it is. I found it. Put this. That is so pretty. This here. PBO, PBO, PBO Studios. Fire. It is very beautiful. Fire. Because I think Fire. what I want to do.
Oh, I gotta move this back up here for this. See what happens when I start doing any crafty kind of thing? I move closer and closer to my belly. <laughs> and then no yeah, it might I get too much stuff going on right here. Oh, where'd that pretty stamp go? Oh, here it is. All right, I need a big big a big sample. Where's that other stencil at? Where did you go? So what's everybody doing for like the fourth of July? Are you doing anything um exciting, Miss Star Miss Um Miss Um Happy Ray of Sunshine Crafty? Negatory. Negatory. Hmm. Negatory. Oh, don't dry up before I can get this on there. Yeah, we're um we're not doing anything pretty fancy either. What is today? Today's the second. Okay, so the fourth is on Sunday. Oh, okay. May the fourth be with you. I I'm hoping that my daughter makes her special her special cheese dip. Oh my gosh. It's so good. Her special cheese dip. See, all I think about doing on holidays is eating, you know, just eat. Oh, Joe's going to Savannah for the day. That's nice. Jennifer and Jeffrey went to Savannah one time. You know what I thought was so cool? Because she kept um she kept sending me like little videos and stuff. There was like like a bus. Well, it wasn't like a bus. It was like a not a bus, but it was sort of like a bus. But um but it was like a like a like a bar thing. But it was like a like the bar there and people could sit there and have their margaritas or whatever. And um when the lights start flashing, everybody had to pedal. So you had pedals and you had to pedal and then the thing would start driving. And then driver would be up there and he'd steer it around and and um yeah. Now she only sent me a picture of it. She didn't go on it because of course she had Jeffrey with her and Jeffrey didn't have any fake ID. It's one of those drinking things you ride. Yeah, it is. It was like a drinking thing. But I thought it was pretty cool that you could just pedal. Everybody just started pedaling, screeching. The whole thing was open, you know. It had all these cool lights. I thought it looked pretty cool. I think it would have been fun. I could have draw drink my Shirley Temple drinks and had fun. Probably not, but but oh yeah, God. I um but um oh you are gonna go on one of the haunted history tours? Oh yeah, they have those too. One of the things that my daughter said was that when she, because they were going on like little bus tours or something where you get on the bus and um, then there's somebody in the bus that's telling you, you know, stories about the area and stuff. But like, I think the, the, they said the, the old buildings and old houses where the um, doors were painted blue. I think the doors or the door frames were painted blue and that was to keep the ghosts away or something like that. That's where they saw the ghosts. I think. I don't don't I don't know if I've got the um <laughs> I don't know if I got the whole story right, but there's some there's a door, there's doors painted a certain color and i think it's blue and it has it means that there's a ghost inside and joe she's afraid of those she if she drinks too much she'd fall off her seat yeah and if you fell off your seat while you was pedaling you would fall under the concrete street or brick street whatever it is they might have a seat you can wear they might have seat belts yeah Yeah, I would, and you know, um, 
Jennifer said that she didn't get to see as much history as she was hoping to see there. She was hoping to see more history when she went. They went last summer. We went on this bus tour. Yeah, they went on a, a, well, I guess you can get on a bus here and there and everywhere, you know, or something. And they got on a bus. They had a couple different buses because she would um, tape, videotape the what the guy was were saying. And so they would dress, you know, they would, the clothing that they, they would wear, the people that did the talking, they were all, their costumes were that in that era and stuff like that. They looked cool, really cool, really extremely cool. Okay. Yeah, that much. Awesome. I'm telling you. Ooh, I'm going to have stuff all over me. I have a book that I haven't read it. Well, I started reading it. I don't remember what the name of it now is. But it all is based in Savannah. i got to finish reading that book. I take spells when I read a lot. And then all of a sudden, I don't read nothing. We went to... We, um... What was that? What's that beast is there next to it? Oh, this is not the stuff. Wrong way. Wrong. A beach next to Savannah? Yeah. Is it Tybee? I think it's Tybee. Is it Tybee? Oh, I know nothing about that. Yeah. Me and my husband went there. It was so much fun. Joe, Joe wants to get together with you one weekend and go, Ray. <laughs> Yeah, it is timing. I tell you, there's this little hole in the wall there where you can get an awesome BLT. That's all I got. No, it was a fish sandwich. My husband got a BLT, but it was a fish sandwich. Oh I love a fish sandwich. It was mm. so good. The Garden of Good and Evil. That is the book, Bootsy. That's exactly the book I have. The Garden of Good and Evil, and I have not read though. I started reading it and then didn't finish it. I need to. I guess I'll have to start over now. So I done forgot everything I read. She done forgot. You done forgot. Yes, I got. I got my memory is a little bit flaky. It's. It's. Um. I used to have a real good memory once. The only, thing I God, the only thing I remember now is when it's time to eat. Anything else? Not so much. Not so much. <laughs> There's all kinds of dog Midnight here. in the Garden of Good and Evil. 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 Oh, okay. Eugenia says there's only professional fireworks allowed at her in her area over there in Oregon because extreme fire danger. Yes, always fire all over there on the west coast. Always. Yeah. They have a severe drought. Well, we've been having quite a bit of rain the last few days, and now that... um. Elsa is on her way. She's going to give us some more rain. Miss Elsa. Miss Elsa is going to give us some more rain. Unless she fizzles out. She might fizzle out. She might do some fizzling. I don't know. Fizzle. A fizzle. Yeah. I want her to fizzle out. I like a light hurricane. Those are kind of fun, but... If it's a lightweight hurricane. Oh, see? And Eugenia says they have cycle pubs here where she lives. Okay, so that's what they're called is a cycle pub. Well, I knew there had to be a name for it. A cycle pub. Mm hmm That's cute. I think we have a place down south of us is Ybor City. And... um. <laughs> Gosh, geez, Bootsy and his knees. They keep making that noise. Um, 
and keyboard studio has that kind of stuff. Yeah, if I push this way, it squeaks. Oh no! If I pull this, okay, now I don't want to squeak. Your heel, your your knees are healed. They're healed, Bootsy. They're healed. All right, mixing the colors is not good. FYI, it ain't like the paint. They turn into mud. Yeah. But you can keep putting paint on top of paint. I mean, put paint when it dries, put more. No, I'm talking about those uh, those fabric paints. Oh, the fabric They're paints. They're too liquidy. They start, they go together. And see? Mm -hmm. I mean, it's not bad, but they're not that color. They're not that dark. No, but it's pretty still. It's pretty. That's all you can ask for is pretty. You can't get gorgeous. Just pretty. Yes, I can. You yes, do anything can, you can, Lizzie. We can. You can do anything you want. Anything you want to do. Anything you can do. I can do better. I can do anything better than you. <laughs> no, you can't. Yes, I can. <laughs> uh, I have my mother. All right, all right. Look at that. Oh, now that is good. That is very pretty. That's I very use, pretty. I use my little, my little scrapey dude hickey thing. That's See, what I you use the scrapey dude hickey thing. I got these little things. Like this one is spiky. And this one looks like a little mop. Oh. And then this one has like four little prongs in it. What? What? Um. The AliExpress. Oh, that AliExpress. Oh, that place. You probably can get it on Amazon. Shoot, yeah. they should sell them in the dollar the dollar tree because it's about the quality of it. Yeah. Still cool. Yeah. Oh, I could still pull off this one. I put something over it. Boy, I sure got a lot of paper here. This is like cool stuff. Have you been pulling? I ain't seen nothing. What? Have you been pulling? I ain't seen nothing. You ain't seen nothing? I ain't seen nothing. It's because you're busy. I ain't seen nothing. Let's do some of this weird freaky things. I'm trying to just organize a few items here. Stop it. You're supposed to be creating. Look at this stuff. Man, oh man, oh man. See, I, I've been... Um, Ooh, I can make circles with this one. Look at that. Yes, please. Thank you. Did I run out of fabric? Oh, no, I got a couple more pieces right here. Okay, now put those right there. Put this right here. I got a big fat pile of stuff. A big fat old pile of stuff. Okay, now what? Seven o'clock. Hmm. Dismiss. Look, swirlies. Pretty, pretty swirlies. Are you gonna have to go? Um, no, I just gotta go get my medicine. I gotta go take my drugs. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Joy Robinson. Hello, 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 hello. Hi, Joy. Happy, happy, Joy, Joy. I need a new color. I've got the joy, 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 joy down in my heart. Down in my heart. <laughs> down in my heart. Mm hmm That's right. Mm-hmm. I'm upset right now about this big brayer. I guess I need to go put it under some water. 
Yeah, I'm gonna um, I'm gonna do some brayer shopping because I'm using this um, Stampin' Up thing, which that works pretty good, but it's got a it's got a stamp in it that shows shows on little onesies, but it really works. Well, this one is was brand new. I think I got that. I'm pretty sure I got that blue stuff in it, and you don't want to roll now. They say there there was when I was looking at them on Walmart.com. There's one that's made especially for jelly plates, and I don't know if they just say that. So the jelly enthusiasts will buy it, or what, or what? But um, so I'm going to do some research on those things. <laughs> well, mine is uh the Jane Davenport. Oh, Jane. So one, and then the little one is the Ranger one. Well, so they should both be good brands then. Yeah, but I, I think I messed this one up. But if I think if I wash it, it'll be all right. Yeah. Leave it up to me. You're doing good. You're doing good, Ray. Happy Ray of Sunshine Crafty. <laughs> you never say my name right. <laughs> well, again, I think I get all the words right, but I don't think I get them in order. You don't you you never say crafty, you just say happy ray of sunshine, that's what you say. Oh but okay. right. Oh, but isn't your channel say crafty sunshine? Yeah. Oh that's that's okay. That's where I was I wonder if I put this stencil on here and then take this right. fabric. I'm sure through. half the people don't even know who I am anyway, so that's all right. <laughs> Everybody knows who you are. Ah! They ain't so. Yeah, we're trying to gel print on, on, on fabric, Joy, and it's kind of joyful. But we're done, got some on I got some on fabric, some on paint. Uh, some on paint. Yeah, gel painting on paint. Mm -hmm. Paint on paint on paint. Something's not right with this woman here, me. Let me see if I can take this paint off of the stencil with this. Or Storley's with this one. See? Then if I go this right here. How about the mop? Then, and then if I go Ooh, right mop. here. The mop makes like little bursts. Hmm. Oops, my snood is falling off. Not oh. the snood. It's the snood. One of my snoods. I'm not kidding you. I went to go put my snood on my head, and there was a string that come a string. Let me see if I still have it right here. The whole thing pulled apart. This here is now my snood. It's just a whole bunch of string. How it dare it. Come all undone. But the string is nice. I'm saving the string because it's going to be hair on a doll. That is not allowed. I know. I bought the cheapest ones they had, you know. But this now that pretty I'm cool. cool. What? That is, it looks like blue jeans. Is it really blue or am I seeing things? No, it's a it's a navy, yeah. And it has a little bit of leftovers in it. I think they're green. Leftovers. Yeah. Mm-hmm. That's good. Leftovers are good. Leftovers. Leftovers are lovely. That may have ruined my stamps. Oh no, it's gonna cool. It's gonna come off. They don't work. They don't work though. These no. really will make cool backgrounds, Joy, because I'm already thinking about um, slow stitching background for slow stitching. I wonder. Oh, I just had an idea. I Let's just had an idea. 
just an idea just roared, wafted through my brain. Gosh, I have Bootsy. He keeps up with them scrappy knees. Okay. I need a fabulous color. Oh, there's Amazing Maisie. She says hello to you, Miss Crafty Sunshine. Do you know Hi. Amazing Maisie? Hi, Maisie. I don't know who Maisie is. How you doing, lady? Long time no see. Long time, Minoshi. Um, Ray Raymond? No, you. <laughs> Are you why calling me Raymond? Why did, why did I call? Why did I call you Raymond? Oh, <laughs> Lord, have mercy. Oh, uh, okay, Raymond. <laughs> have you decided when you're going to have your next um? No. Sale? <laughs> well, no. That, no, that no came up quickly. I'm trying to recover from the last one. Oh, you're in recovery mode? Now neither one of them will spin. I'm upset, y'all. Don't get upset. It's all good. Y'all. Y'all. So you sound like a, y all, y all, y all, you sound like a southern veil, y'all, with that y'all word. You all. Everybody's been grocery shopping. Amazing Maisie just got home from grocery shopping, too. Awesome. All right. We should let this dry, and then I should do one over the top. And then, no, we should pull it. I'm doing a girl. Okay. But I don't know if it's going to work. I haven't had much success with the stamps for some reason. Now Bootsy's knee walked over at your at your end. Ooh, this one might work. It will. It will work. Work. Work it, girl. It will work. Now let me see if I put this on here. <gasps> Renee Munn. <gasps> Hi, Renee. It is so good to see your smiling face here. Oops, Ooh, this yeah. is turning into a muck, looking very mucky. Moyaka, ah, ah, moyaka, muck. Hey, now. Ah, hey, now, little angry dog. You need to go out. No. You need to go out. Toy. She wants to stay in and she wants to pee. Ah, no, they're fighting over the toy. Oh. Yes, we hear you. Out. So. So. Okay, I need to get something bright on here. We need to have You can go. You bright. can go. Find out yonder. Play out yonder in the paw paw patch. Now. All right. Here's a piece in there. I don't think it's dry enough yet. But if I'm going to pull it on fabric, it don't need to be dry, does it? No, 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 no. Okay. I just don't think it's going to come out. I think I'm going to have to do it on paper if I want to see it. We'll do one on the paper and then we'll try the fabric. The stamps are just not coming out on the fabric. Doesn't get the detail. Well, darn. What did I do with my other stamp? Did I drop it in the floor or something? Lost it. It ran away from home. Do I have my be darned. I'll use this sleep instead then. here oh that's better no right. I made my ugly into something beautiful
There we go. That's better. Okay, Janice, hurry back. Oh, look, this one ain't even open. Is your one open? Yes, there is one. When I was public speaking, Singing the peace that passive, passive understanding was my one of my warm ups. I was always told that Southern bells were dinglings. Oh no, that couldn't be possible. Yeah, dingling. That's pretty now. All of a sudden, that just got pretty. Just like that. Magically delicious. I'm not going to be able to stay on really, really long because I feel I like I'm, I'm neglecting Jeffrey. I don't want to neglect him. I got you. So you I, I got this piece of fabric. I got one more piece of fabric after this one oh that's pretty it's like the leaves i am not having any success pulling stamps you know what i remember now i remember doing having regular leaves out of the yard and doing it on this one time i remember that now and i put leaves on it and then I would pull a print with the leaves on it, and then I'd pull the leaves off, and I, I got to do that again. Yes, that's good. Yeah, I just remembered that I did that. That was like 114 years ago, but I did it. I remember. My memory's not completely gone with the wind. Ah, no! Uh, I probably ruined it. Nothing's ruined. Mm -mm. See, I have all these papers and none of them are ruined. They're just full of paper. I would love for this one to come up, but I just don't know. I'm not having much success, Lizzie. I need to do a lot of, like, plan. Oh, that's pretty. Now, see, these kind of um, foam stamps are really not all that good for stamping with ink, but boy, are they awesome for stamping with paint. Yeah. And these foam stamps, they're like cheap. They're like very cheap. The foamy chance, the foamy kind, you can make your own. Yeah. Well, I have made some of my own using the, um, like the foam sheets. I like these ones because it's the whole thing is thicker. I feel like I feel like I like them better. Now other people might not like them better. I don't know. But yeah, you can make your own out of out of um, if you have like the steel rule dies and um, you can cut out of that foam, and that makes pretty good stamps. You can kind of see it. But not really good. Let's see what we get. Hi, Fluffy. Where's your boy? Oh, you would just drink water. You got a wet beard. You're so cute. Okay. Now, see this, if I were to put some green leaves on top of that. Okay, let's see. I want to. Okay, I got one more piece of this here, paper. Get this off of here. Ugh. It's still there, Lizzie. Okay. Now, listen to them notes. Mm -hmm. 
Okay, I'm going to need to hush it. Oh, you got a pit bull in there? <laughs> yeah, he's about like an eight, nine pounder. I don't know. He's put on some weight. He could be a ten pounder now. Yeah. And he is not a pit bull. He's a little stinky chihuahua. He sounds like he's a big, big dog with a big butt. <laughs> he wants you to think that. So, um, Jeffrey's little dog, oh my gosh, its little bark is so cute. That little dog's bark is so cute. And, um, now, Tommy Sue's dog has got one named Jack Russell's. Holy smoke, that Russ, that Russell, that bark will go right through your brain. Of what? Jack Russell. Oh my God, those dogs are so hyper. She's not so hyper so much as is that bark. Oh my gosh, that bark or just that's quite a bark. But see, I like it when she's over here because I don't think anybody would ever come through that gate with that dog barking because it just sounds that vicious. Yeah. Yeah. Vicious. 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 I kind of really love her bark. I feel all kind of safe and stuff. Ooh, that had slime in it. Some of my paints have slime. I, I think like that comes like with that. The old age. Ah! Oh, this table. Uh -uh. Why'd you make such a mess on your table? You should have a nice, neat table like mine right here. Yeah, not so much. Yeah, I love these leaves. Yes, Eugenia. And see, so I put the background and then Ooh. the red background, then put some green leaves on there. Ray needs some WD-40, but then so does Bootsy. He needs it on his knee. Okay, I'm going to put this. I got a pot of water and it was soaked right down here on the floor beside of me. I just dump my stuff in there. Now, oh, I still have one more piece of fabric. Oh, well, I'm going to start. Um, okay, I'm going to take, did I use all that paper? I used all that paper? Yes, I did. Yes, ma'am. Yes, I'm wanna. I did it. I did it. Okay. So I am just going to get my wipes here. Oh, no. I got paper right here. Okay. I got paper right here. <gasps> There's Crystal Castle. Hi, Crystal. Crystal is probably wondering, when is that woman going to send me that button? Hi, Dada, Dada's here too. <gasps> the whole, the whole group. I don't think she put up a notification, Dada. I don't think she did. I, uh, I put it out in her group and my group. Oh, okay. Yeah, the stamp is not working, Lizzie. Which makes me terribly sad. Oh, I don't want you to be sad. I don't want you to be sad. I'm no. So sad. I don't want you to be sad. I want you to be happy. Happy, happy, joy, joy. Happy, happy, joy, joy. Happy, happy, joy, joy. Happy, joy. Hey everybody, let's sing a little song. Mm -hmm. oh. Okay now, okay now, look at that. Oh, that's pretty. And that's on muslin. Huh. Yeah. How about that one? Yeah, I'm going to be doing 
I am going to absolutely be doing more of this now that I've got my foot in the door again, because I did this long ago and then I haven't been doing, but now that I know I can do it on fabric, I do want to do stuff on fabric and I want to learn how to do design to make this stuff work. <laughs> That's what I want to do. Because I free stamp on all this, you know? Mm hmm Now. And see, and, and as we go further and further, as long as you don't try and copy somebody else, you are going to come up with your own style. And, oh, there's my pink, too. Uh, so I'm going to leave my paint, what I have here, in eye view, I think. Well, nothing's actually in eye view. Oh, this paper. Okay. So, ouch. Too much. Too much. Bird's eye view. Okay, put all this in here. And this goes in here. My new thing now is to, when I get done with one craft, I'm putting it away. Well, good for you. I don't know how long that will last. I tell you what, mine's not. Mine's just sit here and just dry up. <laughs> so I am. And then I'll come back maybe tomorrow and fix it. Yeah. Okay. If it's lucky. Here. Let's see if I can stamp her on here. Now, put these. Everything's in my soapy water bucket down there. Now I'll take it to the kitchen sink. You can kind of see it. I don't know. Okay. No, you can't. Okay, these are all my, um, these are now all my pieces of fabric. See this one, you can see the leaves. And see, and all, and you see these started out with 10 by 10s. This one here. Was like green and yellow, and then I put some red leaves on it. This one here is pretty. Then I put memories all over it. And so I can take this apart. Each word will be separate. Memories. And then this one here. I like this one. Smiles. If I put another color down, I think it'll show. Go, Lizzie, go. Go, Lizzie, go. This one here, I think I, I might want to... I don't know what this one here might need some more, but you know what? Let me just try something. I'm just going to try something right now. I'm going to take this and I'm going to tear it. Just do it. And look at this. Now I tore it. And see if when you tear it and it's in little smaller pieces. Uh -huh. It's a whole nother something. Yeah. And see, and then here, this one is different colors. I didn't really get any, like, the only is, the only thing is the, um, the roller that I used was uh, a Stampin' Up for stamping. Hush, go out. And that's what I use. And but I got more of those different rollers, and I'm going to be using them with paint on fabric. And I think I'm going to really like this by just putting the paint on the jelly plate. Use the roller, the the Stampin' Up rollers, run it through the paint, and then paint on fabric. 
And because I think I really am liking, oh, this one. I like this one. That one's got a lot of color. And like tear it apart and then heck yeah, buddy. This one's like greens and reds. Ugh. I give up. And then don't give up, you're fine. This one. Oh, I like this one. This has got, I got a piece of, a piece, a bottle of some kind of golden sort of paint here. I like how that looks. Oh, it's folk art metallic copper. And boy, it really is sparkly. That's neat. I need to get more metallic paint. That's what I need to get. I do not need no paint. I'm just kidding. I'm not getting no more paint. <laughs> Um, I keep thinking I need stuff, but I don't really need stuff. No, don't do it. Now, don't see, go down that rabbit hole. I know. You just sent me a whole box of stuff I didn't need. And boy, do I love it. And, um, and I'm glad I didn't I realize I needed it till I saw it. I'm still enamored by them shoestrings. I'm so excited with them shoelaces. My goodness. Who knew? I know. Such and joy. then this one. So these are really pretty. And they dry pretty good. These are dry. They dried fast. And so I have all of these squares now I that really I can take them apart and sew them together. Take them apart and then sew. Oh, I wonder. Oh, you know what? I will use my old sewing machine my little baby sewing machine with these because i don't know about oh i'm gonna wash them that's right i'm gonna iron them and iron them to set the paint and then wash is that what was told to us yes okay and then i think i'll wash them once they're washed I don't think there'll be any problem with sewing them. It wouldn't gum up. I don't want to go gum up my sewing machine, you know. So. Yeah, I don't go gumming up anything. I don't want to be gumming stuff up. Mm -mm. I think I totally just ruined her face. You did not ruin anything. Oh, I'm going to have to come out there and speak harshly to you. <laughs> Uh-oh. I, I like this. I really like my fabric. Now, look, at I got all them pieces of fabric that I didn't have before. Then I have. I cannot get that brand out. Then I have. Oh, here's another piece of fabric, but this one's not dry yet. So I got to put that up on the top. And then, oops, I got some papers that aren't completely dry, too. Papers. I don't know why paper sticking. I'm really not liking these rollers. Would you quit with your not liking stuff? You gotta like everybody. Like it all. Go back to the other rollers. Like it or lump it. It it never it never did this. It never did that. No, it never. Um. It never, they never got stuck like that. Hmm. I have now got a lot of painty papers. I didn't have a lot of painty papers before. I mean, I did have a lot, but I used them all. Now I have new painty papers. Yeah. And this, this has been fun because I've been doing only fabric art lately, and now I've got some more stuff. You know what would be fun? What would be fun? To make like postcards out of them. Oh, this is true. Yeah. And then mail them. This is very true. One more. One more. Uh oh, I think I hear rain. Uh oh. Is your friend coming to see you? Elsa's not here yet. No. I'll have to watch the weather tonight and see if they give us any update on what Elsa's thinking about. What's Elsa thinking about? 
Elsa's thinking about something. She's thinking. I mean, she's had a bad day for some reason. Somebody ticked her off. You know, Mother Nature and her cousins, you know. Cordula says, remember the cabs. I know what she's talking about. She's saying, remember the carbs. She's been telling me about my um, carbs. She's helping me with the carbs. Oh, Lord. I know. It ain't so. Somebody has to help me, though. I am, I am getting a little bit... Yeah, I don't know what I'm getting a little bit, but my carbohydrate intake seems to be getting a little bit out of hand. <laughs> yep. I've done really good with like the sugars, like the like the simple carbs, like all of the cookies and cakes and that kind of thing. I'm doing good with that. It's the complex carbs that I'm having a problem with. Yeah, it's all them Chex Mix. Because it's what? <laughs> all them Chex Mix. Chex Mix, yeah, that's true. What, did you just hear me? Did you just hear me getting into my bag? <laughs> <laughs> I know you got it somewhere near close to you. <laughs> I know, but usually the whole bag usually lasts to me for... um at least a week and a half in this room. Mm -hmm. Look at the serving size. I mean, I'm sure it's like barely a handful, if that. Mm -hmm. Which, I mean, come on. The, the best, I'll tell you the best thing to do is not to eat it out of the bag. Okay. Just take you out a portion and like put it on a napkin or something and then that's the only part you eat because if you start eating it out of the bag you don't stop i'm pretty good at stopping now because i'm getting scared now but um like what i'm going to eat this evening is i'm going to have cottage cheese and some unsweetened applesauce and with some frozen blueberries and my ground um, I have this powdery stuff, which where I ground, I grind up flax seeds and chia seeds. I grind them together, and it makes like a powdery substance. Oh, I love chia. Ch -ch -ch chia. And then I mix that in with everything, and so that's what I'm going to eat for supper. supper. I like chia seeds in my water. I just like it in the straight up water. Chia seeds, really? Yeah, I like them because they swell up. To me, they taste like cucumber. It tastes like cucumber water. But that's me. Oh, I and have never put, I never put them in water. It's a texture thing, too. They do swell up. They're kind of like, to me, it kind of gets like a boba tea ah. kind of thing. I don't know if you've ever had those. Oh, I'm going to put some in water and see what it does. Oh, yeah. Because that might works. be... At first, they're still hard, but you give them a little bit, they'll swell up, and it's really cool. Oh, I'm a, I'm a, I'm going to say because I don't have all of mine ground up. I bought big bottles of it, and then I just grind a little bit at a time. And when I run out of the ground stuff, then I grind some more. But see, I thought I, well, maybe it's just the flaxseed, but um, I heard that. I, maybe it's just the flaxseed that doesn't do you any good unless it's ground. Really? Yeah. Well, That's what I, I heard. I thought it's supposed to be like a fiber type thing. You're supposed to need it like that. Well, yeah. Well, now somewhere I read that it has to be ground up. And so I ha I put it in like a coffee grinder thing. And yeah, I, I think like a powder. This one. I think I'm going to have to just go back over them and redo. And, and you know what? That's what you can do, too. You can have all of your things, and then after they're all dry, then you can go over. Even the pages, like this page here on mine, I think it's a little bit, like, dark and dreary. But I think I, if I went over it with some yellow and put some stamping on it with yellow paint, or even if I just take and what do they call it? Pounce? Like yeah. pounce. 
found. And have it sprinkled like it looks like it's snowing, then even that, I think, it would liven it up. So I think anything that you do is, it, nothing is a fail. Nothing at all is a fail. You, because you can go further with it. You can take it apart and use just parts of it. Parts is parts. I just yeah. try to get prints, and sometimes it just doesn't work. Yeah. Oh. All right, my love. I'm going to have to go because I've got to go out there and spend some time with Jeffrey. Got because, you. because um, he's my boy, and I'm neglecting him, and I don't neglect grandchildren. So anyhow, I love you guys. And and dill pickles for a snack is a sort of free food. That's pretty good too, but then all the salt, you know. I gotta yeah. watch the salt too, see? <laughs> yeah, so. You just can't eat nothing. Just get I your just and chew I, it. I just can't eat nothing. Mm -mm. I'm not eating nothing. <laughs> I could get flavored ice cubes. Okay, good night, Bootsy. Good night, everybody. Bye, -bye good everybody. Y'all have a great night. Yeah, are you leaving too with Happy Ray of Sunshine? Who, huh? Are you leaving too? Yeah. Oh, okay. Thank you guys for coming and hanging with me and Ray. This is fun. We want to get together more often. Sometimes it's going to be on my channel. Sometimes it'll be on Happy Ray's channel. And never know what we're going to be doing. It's whatever we feel like doing at the moment. Happy fingers. Yes. <laughs> Happy fingers right there. Look at them. Good night. Oh, yeah, Good night you up here next time. <laughs> Thank you so, so, so much. And now that we've done this much with the gel plate, the next time we do gel plate will be even different. I'm not going to say better, but it will be different. Could yeah, be what Lizzie said. Bye. Okay, love you guys. Bye-bye.